Hey guys, um, it's Regan, obviously. <laughs> I am going to show you guys how I straighten my hair, and I know this video, okay, so a lot of people say I don't need to straighten my hair. They haven't seen my hair after, like, I brush it in the morning. When I brush it in the morning, when I go to school, about 30 minutes after I get out of school, it frizzes up like that, like, frizzes, like, it looks like that almost. It looks like I have huge split ends and all this other stuff. So, yeah. I'm sorry the lighting is really bad. I'm trying to like fix that. Okay, that's what we're So, I just have my straightener here. This is for, it's from Ceramic. Um, yep. And it's got the little turn dial on the inside. And it's got the on and off button. So, I just turned mine on 100. 45 about and it heats up really quick and sometimes I mean like you can use like a heat glove I use this sometimes sometimes like I use it for my little curling but you know you can do whatever um I already put heat protector on I use Tresemme I don't have it with me I put it on in my bathroom like I took the shower so yeah this is my hair it's nice looking, I guess. Okay, so I'm just going to set my straightener down. Um, and... So, here's my hair thin thing. It's got a bunch of things in it. So, the things that you'll need, obviously, you'll need a straightener. You need a Conair, 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 I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, you just need a brush. I'm using my Conair one. You just need a brush, like a brush, regular brush. And then you need a flat, um, uh, what are these called? Um, I forget what they're called, but you just need one of the flat ones. Um, then you'll need one of these, the cloth clips. I'm just using this from the dollar store. And you might, if you want, you can use like a head, a stretchy headband. Or. Bitch. I don't have it in here, so no, no, you can't use that. But you can use a butterfly clip too, if you want. I prefer to use claw clips. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna check the straight my batteries. I'll put on my heating glove for this. Okay, so it's pretty much warm. So the first thing you're gonna do, um, you just wanna brush out your hair and make sure there are no knots or tangles in it. You can use a comb. I prefer to use a brush because I think that with brushes. It's kind of a little easier brush. So like my hair looks really straight, but no, it's not. It's not. So, so you want to brush your hair back like this and part it how you want. Sorry, I'm using my camera because my mirror is behind. Just want to part it in the middle like that, and then. I take my pinkies and right above your ear line, you want to just take it and pull it back. And, so, okay. and then you just want to take it and want to twist it once around and then pull it up like that. Make a clip. So then, you want to make sure, oh, okay, hold on, sorry, you want to kind of make sure, oh, sorry, <laughs> it messed up. Okay, so, yet again, brush out your hair. If you mess up, it's okay. Trust me, I mess up a lot. Because I, 
I usually straighten my hair, but I'm not the best at it yet. Sorry, I have a, I have One Direction's um makes you beautiful stuck in my head. Okay, <laughs> I finally got to work. Right when I started to sing my favorite song. Okay, so you want to make sure these two seconds are kind of even, and it, trust me, these are even. If you like, if you brush it out, they're even. They're pretty much even. And if you want to make sure that they're even, you can just uh, do like that. You'll even just pull some from this side and add it. Oh wait, I did that wrong. Pull from some from this side and add it. No! <sighs> Sorry. No. <sighs> Pull some from it and just add it to it. Okay, I'm pretty much fine with this. Okay, so you're gonna take this and see, this is where you might want to use a butterfly clip too. You can take your butterfly clip over my neck right here and you can take it, take it and just. With it, wherever that piece of hair is bothering, I just hold it right there. I look really stupid. Okay, so, and you're just gonna take these two seconds. If it's too thin, or if it's fine for you, you can move it. But I like to split it in two so it gets straightened. And you're just gonna take it one second and flip it back. You wanna split this in half. And this one, flip it back. Okay. And then you're gonna make sure your straightener is warm. And it's really easy how to straighten your hair. I mean, you just like this. Slowly bring it down. You can go fast or slow, whichever way you do. I think that you kind of go slow. I just go over it maybe once or twice. So, so that's how you shake it. Yeah. Um, and I kind of just do this every morning. So this is kind of like a getting ready video, hair version. So you can call it whatever you want. My hair is still kind of wet, so if you hear seagulls or pops, it's just like my hair is wet. Let's just take a shower. <laughs> I just want to make sure, I just want to go over it a couple Okay, so this is just the bottom half. I choose to do it layer by layer. I feel that it gets straightened better. So, okay, and then you just want to unclip this. I just clip on my shirt. Right here. Oh, okay, that did not want to stay there.
brush your hair up. And then you take the top section. Like this. You're going to twist it up. Kind of like that. Okay. So you can either take your big claw clip or you can take your mini clip. I prefer you to use my big one because that's even more comfortable with it. In my head. Okay. Okay. I just have this. and just brush it out right after. You can put this back behind your head. Oh, where's my clip? Okay, and then you take the clip, take it out, kind of pull it up, and flip it down. Brush it out. And then we're going to take this part. Yeah, this heats up really quick and it burns your hair. So you, that's why you want to make sure that you have heat protection. Okay, and you're just going to pull this back yet again. And unclip this, and then this is like. Okay, and you want to make sure this is like pushed back. Okay, and you just want to hold it like this. So this is the straight inside. You can tell it's kind of different because it's straight. And this side's kind of wavy in a way. So we're going to fix that. So you're going to take this part of your hair and you're going to split it in half like you would with your bottom half. And you're going to take a little bit extra so it's kind of thin. And take it, curl it up. You're just going to twist it kind of like that, and then you're going to flip it up, and you're going to clip it, and then you want to take this and kind of brush it out, make sure there's no little knot. Oh, I have a huge knot in the bottom of my hair. Okay, so I'm uh, just gonna shorten. Like, um, so I will fast forward these parts as best I can. I'm not the best video editor, so you just kind of just want to keep on straightening it until you feel like you it's straight as straight as you want it. There you go. That's as straight as I kind of want it. I 
kind of like to split it in half. This, the reason I'm splitting it in half so much is so it will be layered. Because I, it will like, it was layered. It like it's, it lasts longer. I don't know why, I just feel like it does. And see, it's got kind of, it's not completely straight like that. It's kind of, it's straight, yet yeah, it's got some volume to it. So I, that's why I love it with my hair, especially. Yeah. So then you're going to take this piece again. Whoops. You're going to brush it out with your brush. Take a straightener. Grab it right here. Straighten down. And you want to make sure that when you're up here, you don't want to hold it too long. Because if you do, it'll make a little crease mark. And that is never good because that can tell people. So like it kind of shows them that you straighten your hair and like you kind of want it to look natural. See how this side's kind of longer? So when I drop this, when I drop this part of my hair, it'll make it look a lot longer. So I'm just going to push this back and grab this. So you're just going to just brush it out and then grab it and straighten it. Grab it straighten. Grab it straighten. Grab it straighten. And then I just take my panel brush, my flat brush, and kind of just brush it out all together on the stick. Yeah, so that is how. Okay, and then you see how my part is down straight down the middle? I don't part my hair. Again. So I go like this again. So this is how I straighten the hair. Um, and then when you kind of part it again, kind of just want to go over it a couple times, maybe with straightening, just to make sure that it's not gonna come loose, not gonna get too frizzy on the end. I especially like to re-straighten my ends because my ends like to get really flared out. So you kind of just want to fix that with the straightener. See, it's really easy straightening your hair. It just take it takes me about 20 minutes to straighten the hair all together if it's washed, because then I have to blow dry it. Okay, so this is how I straighten my hair. Um, right after this video, I'll be posting how I curl my hair because I'm curling my hair tomorrow, so I need to practice, I'm not the best at it. So yeah, and then after that video, I will show you which video I'm uploading next. Um, I'm gonna, uh, yes, I'm posting a lot, but I mean, I post a lot because I feel like, I post a lot in one day because I feel like I don't post enough videos. So yeah, so this is how I straighten my hair, I've said that a minute several times. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, please check in in a couple minutes to see how I curl my hair. Alright, see you guys later. Bye!